the question that we've been asked is, uh, you know, let's say I wrote a few checks or I even did electronic fund transfers. Uh, I know the requisition number. I know the check number. How do I find where it is and who it is, right? Uh, if you generally know the matter, you can go the matter and find it there. But sometimes you don't know the matter, you just remember the check number. So in that case, what you can do is first you need to go to the chart of accounts and then you go to that bank where you believe you transfer, you know, put it, let's say in this one, like I'm going to go to the pool trust TD bank. And once you go there, you can do document generation and then under other, there's something called method of payment. And let's search this entire year. I'm just going to download for this year all the transactions that I had and it's sort them by method of payment. So if I open this document, you will see that first it will sort it by, uh, you know, checks. Like this is all the checks that I have wrote this year. The second page, it's sorting it by electronic fund transfer. These are all the electronic fund transfers I did this year. So, you know, it, it's very simple uh, that what it does is what this report does is it goes one by one and then uh, sorts it so again to summarize let me do it just uh, for the fund for last year so i can go to other method of payment and i'll go to quarterly and i'll go to the last quarter just to have more transactions and i have download and you will see that it will go ahead analyze every transaction and it will print it by section by section by section so in this one the first one is bank drafts as you see here the second one is certified checks Right. It gives you all the certified, then it's checks, right? After checks, it is, uh, oh my God, you've written quite a few checks here. And you can actually search now, but because it's a PDF document, you can now search for check 44452 or something like that. After that, it's direct debits, right? So it goes and sorts all your electronic fund transfers by method of payment. And once you have this document, you can actually search for it. And then from there, you can actually know, oh, that's a trust transfer for this invoice uh, for Sonia Bikram. And then you can go to that matter. So again, to summarize under document generation other, there's something called method of payment. And that would basically give you a listing of all your transactions by method of payment.